One of the great features uh, on the C2 2855 and, and the other products in the range as well, the 2755 and the 2655, is auto switching. At the moment, you can see I've got nothing on my background because I've got the cables here in my hand. I'll just show you how simple it is to set up. I just go to my shortcuts menu, uh, and if I come down to the bottom here in settings, right down the bottom here, auto switch is on. When auto switch is set on, you'll see that uh, in our live menu, you can see we're cycling between our inputs. So it's cycling between uh, the HDMI, the DVI-U. Remember the DVI-U, we can attach adapters for a number of different flavors of video. Uh, three gig SDI, uh, VGA, so the PCHD, composite video, and, and YC. So cycling through all six inputs. Uh, on the screen, I've got a custom graphic. So you don't have to have this. So um, just set the scene. So we've set up a little huddle room in our office, uh, or we've got a conference room, and we want anybody to plug the HDMI cable in. And you know how difficult this is in a, in a number of uh, boardrooms you've been to, a number of meetings, how difficult it is to find the right input uh, from the right cable, the right input. This is dead simple. So first of all, we're going to present off this PC. So I'm going to plug in uh, my HDMI. Like I say, it doesn't have to be HDMI. It can be any of the other inputs. Uh, we're cycling through, and it's found HDMI. It's, it's up on the screen. Uh, I finish my first presentation. I pass over uh, the HDMI to my boss. He plugs it into his PC. Once again, we're cycling through the inputs. And then we found it, and it comes up. Like I said, that's where I've got the TV1 logo. That could be your own corporate logo or, or welcome uh, logo up there. So he's finished presenting. Uh, but what I want to do now is actually collaborate a little bit more and be able to switch between them while keeping them both plugged in. So let's unplug again so we lose the input. Let's go back to the first scenario. We're plugged in. It's going to find the input. And what I'm going to do now is just try and confuse the system. I'm going to plug in a second input. So we're up and going with the first clip. I plug the second in. And you notice that now I can manually switch because it's got both there. And to manually switch, it's really simple. Just switch between one and two uh, on the inputs. That's auto switching, really powerful. If you want to make a huddle room, a meeting room, uh, maybe you haven't got a whole bunch of budget to put automation around it or to put clever wiring in the room, just simply get a 2855, put it in there, leave the cables on the desk, and it's self-service, it's easy to do. So that's auto switching on the C2 2855. If you want to find out more, talk to one of our sales reps. Uh, why don't you uh, come to one of our training sessions and get some hands on yourself.